guys, this is April and for today's video, I will show to you my self-care plan on how to manage myself among those 8 aspects of our self. So if you are excited, just keep watching. It is important that we actually take good care of ourselves because it is our tool to achieve our dreams and goals in life. By having an 8 hour sleep is an example of it and don't forget to thank God after waking up in the morning. After that, getting up in bed, washing your face and take a bath is an important one and do some exercises like walking, running and some non-locomotor exercises to keep us healthy. On taking care of our sexual self is to know the person deeper. We don't just date just because it is a trend but we date to marry a person in the right time. Don't fall for a mere flowery words, protect yourself and preserve it to a man that God will give you in his right time. Be patiently waiting. In order to attain our emotional self and take care of it, we have to choose a situation where we can express our emotions selectively. We don't need to react to everything that's happening, especially when it's negative. To avoid stress, always stay positive and smile more often. Continue your life and always choose your battle. Don't post everything on social media just to get the sympathy of other people because everything in that world is a world full of criticisms and they don't help you solve the situation but rather it will make it worse. Make your digital self a line of how your personality is. Just promote every positive thing so that people will see it and it will encourage them to move forward. Our purchase seems to determine of who we are. It can be seen in our lifestyle. In order to take care of this is to purchase material things wisely. If it's a need or wants, we need to avoid being materialistic because if we happen to be in that situation, it will define ourselves as a person who is not contented about life. It is important that we have a social self in these days to avoid negative thoughts because if we didn't take care of it, our self would not be balanced. We need to try to reach out our friends and spend quality time together with them despite of how busy we are today. Unwind and do things that will make you happy and alive. As a Filipino, I always find time to watch television for some updates of what's happening in our country and as well as on others. More often, I'm constantly interested about governments and laws. And with that, being political is showing how you respect and care for others. And lastly, our self would not be completely fine if not for our spiritual self. Many people think that it's enough that we have those other aspects but forgot the most important one. To satisfy our soul, we need to have our spiritual aspect to keep our sanity and this keeps us going from all the hardships in life. Personally, this aspect is what I practice since I'm a kid and is part of my whole entire life. I can't live without this aspect because more than anything, we need God to provide everything for us.